If you're ever traveling with cats, this is what, I'm not excited about driving for 20 hours in the car with two cats, but they're part of the family now. So what I did was put uh, these, they're like paper logs that use for a fire pit out back and put them under the cage here just to keep them exactly level and straight. And then I got two crates and opened the, the center because they have a door on this side and then they had a, a wall door there and open that up and inside here they have a bed food and water will go there or we're leaving in the morning bright and early and then there's a little hammock here this one was specifically for cats and then took the seat belt <clears throat> excuse me took the seat belt and wrapped it around so that it's really secure I mean this thing is about as level and in there as it can get so we can lock that door up and then if you go around here, I got a kitty litter box here for the, let me get back to Indiana. If you go around to this side, on this side is the same thing. There was two crates put together. They were, I caught them on sale at Petco actually for like, um, I think they were 60, $57 a piece. And on this end of this little condo cat carrier thing is going to be, uh, this was Fancy's little bed when I adopted her from Petco. And then another hammock. This hammock was for a ferret, but they love it. And uh, another a litter box here. So they can go litter box. They've got food, water, litter box, two hammocks, a bed, and a bed. And it's all locked in tight and secure with the um, seat belts with a towel underneath. And then I have a Victoria's Secret blanket that came free if you purchase so much, and that's gonna go over the top so that they don't see um, traffic going by. But the back window has a um, shade that goes up and down, and I'm gonna keep it up so that they don't see traffic because I think that will freak them out. Not fancy so much, but the Bengal, it will freak him out because he is a hunter. And I'll show you what I mean by a hunter in one second. But that's my cat condo for traveling and I'm not sure I'm going to travel in the car anymore because driving is going to be horrible going 20 hours in the car but I'm going to stop at my brother's house and spend a couple days up there so he's at the halfway mark so that's the way that's going to be I've got kitty litter kitty scoop and a litter box so as soon as I get back to Indiana I can open this crates up in the garage so I know that they don't get out and um let them go potty, but let's, let me show you. I think he, Cheeto is probably doing some hunting now. And I know that these cats, especially Cheeto, not fancy, she doesn't care, but look, this is what I mean when I say Cheeto's a hunter. See him up there? Sometimes people are like, how does he get up there? Yes, he's hunting birds and he's caught lizards and bring, tries to bring them in the house. And I put all my plants here in the center so that my pool guy who is amazing is going to water he's going to take care of my pool i took the tile things out pool house is closed up everything is getting closed up because i'll be gone for six months five months and cheeto is up here i mean this wall is a good it's all of six foot what are you hunting for buddy what are you hunting for where's fancy pants there she is fancy's so big and heavy after she got her teeth pulled out, she um, all she wants to do is eat. She's hungry all the time, so she's too big and heavy to crawl up on anything. She can't jump up on anything. Cheeto has fallen into the pool. He's jumped up there and down, jumping down, but he's learning where he can jump up and where he cannot. So this is going to be a kitty cat adventure in the car. Hey buddy, are you hunting? He sees birds and... Lizards, I wonder how he's going to do when we get to Indiana because there he goes. <laughs> and there goes Fancy. Uh, because I'm not going to let him outside. I don't have a screened in lanai like here. So, and there's chipmunks, raccoons, groundhogs, fox, and every other thing in my backyard up there. I don't want him to get eaten or hurt or rabies. Fancy would, could care less. She does. She's not a hunter. She's a lover. So that is a cat on the move travel video. And I will, the next time I see you, we'll be in Indiana. I love you all. Thanks so much for watching. Safe travels. Be kind to each other. Bye.